welcome guys um, today we'll be doing n1 mathematics tvet college exam preparations okay so now the first question says simplify each of the following without the use of a calculator obvious using the rules of exponents okay so now here 1.1 this is 1.1 you are given you are given x to the power 3 to the power 4 multiplied by 2x to the power of 2 so now you it will be x to the power 3 multiplied by 4 you left x to the power of 12 multiplied by 2 to the power 2 that's 4 okay and x to the power 2 okay so now here the coefficient of x to the power 12 is 1 right so 4 multiplied by you multiply the coefficients so it will be 4 multiplied by 1 that's plus 2 4 right and then now you are adding same variable it will so now same base you add the exponents you are going to have x to the power of 12 isn't it 12 plus 2 yeah which is equals to 4x to the power of 14. So here, the rule, normally the rule that we use, we use the rule um, which says a to the power of m. These are the rules of, um, of exponents, right? This is the rule that I use to the power of n, which is equal to a to the power of m n and then the rule that i use here um is uh, is the rule which says a to the power of n multiplied by a to the power of m which is equals to you just add the exponent a to the power of n plus m isn't it so let's go to number two let me erase so now let's go to 1.1.2, we simplify this um, expression. Let me rewrite it here. We have got 1.1.2, okay, which is given by cube root of negative 27, negative 27x to the power 3 cubed multiplied by x to the power of 4 y squared multiplied by x squared y squared all raised to 0. So now we start by here we remove the the square root it's going to be don't forget that here you've got to the power 1 just that you don't see it right to simplify things we can just say negative 27 right to the power of, I said here you've got to the power one, but you don't see it. So here, because there is one, right? This one inside, it will go up. We call it Nelson Mandela rule, Mandela rule actually. So now it will be one, that one which was inside, now it's on top, it's the president, all over by, by three, okay? And then you've got your X, there is to the power three, so it's gonna be three over, Three, this three inside over three, which is outside, okay. And then multiply by x to the power of four y squared multiply by one, right? Here you you know the notation, which is a to the power zero is equals to this is the rule of exponent is equals to one, right? We used this rule, okay? We used this rule. So now here we know that negative 27 
to the power one over three, that's equal to negative three. Yeah. And then that three to the power three, and that's gonna be x to the power one, right? Okay, let me write to the power one so that you can follow. Mapla by x to the power of four, y to the power of two, isn't it? And then negative three x to the power of one here x and x same base we add the the exponents one plus four and y to the power of two so you're going to have negative three x to the power one plus four is five is it it to the power of y two then we're done with this one so we can go to to the second third one Okay, here you have got 1.1.3 a to the power of 4 b to the power of 3 multiplied by a to the power of 4 b to the power of 5 multiplied by 15 a b all over by 5 a to the power 8 b to the power 7 okay so here you 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 can take out the the coefficient the coefficients okay you are going to have um if you take out the coefficients you are going to have um 15 yeah you're going to have 15 a to the power of 4 and then a to the power of yeah it's going to be a to the power of 4 plus four this four right and then here there is one one so it's gonna be plus one isn't it and then you go for the variable b you would be to the power of three yeah plus five plus this one plus one isn't it okay so now all over by five a to the power of eight, b to the power of seven. So now we can say five here one, and then five here it will go three, All right? Okay, so allow me to write um, three. Okay, it's still fine. I can say three, a, to the power of four plus four is eight plus one is nine. So I'm gonna have eight to the power of nine and b to the power of three plus five is eight plus one is nine, all right? All over by a to the power of eight and b to the power of seven, right? Okay, so now we have got a and a. So we can see we've got three so when we when we divide here right here we can use the rule which says a to the power of m all over by a to the power of n so here the rule is say a to the power of m minus n so when you're dividing you subtract the exponent but when you are when you are, when you are multiplying you add the exponent i hope you're together so here the a it will be nine, nine minus eight, and then for p, it's gonna be nine minus seven, right? And then you are going to have three a to the power one, and then b to the power two, right? So that's your final answer. Okay, let's go to 1.2. Let me erase, yeah, so now, Let's go to the last 1.2. You have got um, simplify the following logarithmic without the use of a calculator. Okay, so here at um, 1.1.2, you have got. Um, so here, 1.1.2, you have got um, log of 100 
yeah you will log of 100 plus 6 log 4 base 4 or 4 minus 3 log base 2 8 right so this is what you have here so now here if you don't have you know here if you don't have um, a base we know that the base is, is 10 so you are going to have log you're going to have log log 10 so now let's change this base this 100 so it's going to be 10 to the power of 2 that's 100 10 to the power of 2 that's 100 okay so plus plus okay log 4 log base 4 of of 4 so that's 6 into into 1 right the reason this the 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 the, the law here the law that we used here so you 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 know the law the law it says let me write it here okay so let's say you've got log the log base b right of b is equals to one b b is equals to one okay we use this rule so now it will be six multiplied by one right minus three log two right so here for it we break it down into base and exponent is going to be two to the power of three All right okay so now you are going to to have yes another rule that we have to to apply is is this one we have to apply this rule it's it says log of b let's say you've got log of b log of base b yeah of m to the power k let me just say m to the power of k right so that's equal to your exponent now take it down the power down it will be equal to k right log of base b m right so we have to apply this rule here so now you are two here power down you are two here the power down is going to be two isn't it two log two log ten ten right plus what plus six minus so power down is three is going to be nine right three multiplied by three right power down the log log base two of 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 two right so now you 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 can check here log 10 10 i said log 10 10 log b you use this same rule here I can see this is our rule one. You can use still use the rule one, and then this is our rule two, right? So it's going to be two of two of one, right? Log ten ten. I say this was the same as log four four is one, right? Plus that was that was the reason why we're breaking up this hundred into because we are trying to simplify everything. So we must write some everything, you know, in a shortened form. So now you have got plus six minus nine into one. So you have got two plus, two by one is two plus six. That's going to give you eight, isn't it? Nine by one minus nine, right? Which boils to negative one. Right, that's your answer.
Okay, so now let's go to this, the last one. Let me erase here. Yes, so now 1.2.2 log 36, yes, plus log 6, yes, minus 1 over 3 log 216. So now here, if you can check the base here, we, we know that is 10, but here the base we can just say is the same throughout right unlike the previous one the base here is the same so let's break down this big numbers complex numbers so it's going to be it's going to be what um log it's going to be log yes log six to the power two, right, plus log six. Minus one over three. This is gonna be log, log six multiplied by six, um, 36, right? Multiplied by Six um, should be two sixteen. So here you've got six to the power of three, right? So here you you will notice that you've got you have to use the rule number two, right? Log b m to the power k is equal to power down k log b m, right? So here we can do power down. It's going to be two log of six isn't it plus this one you leave it as it is because this is the smallest number here so you're going to have log six right power down here you're going to have negative three over three that's okay i can write it for you i can just see for you to see negative one over three Multiply by three log of log of six. Okay, so here you've got you've got two log of six plus log of six three and three. So that's negative log. Six. So here you've got plus log six minus log six. So this is zero, right? So you're left with two log of six, and that's gonna be your final answer. Thank you very much. Subscribe, like, and share.